everybody, it's Anna. Welcome to the Tuesday card in this week's tarot story. Today we have the Six of Wands. This is our second six in a row. Yesterday we had the Six of Swords, and I talked about how the number six is connected to feeling in harmony or in balance in the world. Um, but swords are connected to the mind, and wands are connected to the element of fire. So they're about feeling passion and inspiration and confidence. So this card shows a man returning from some victory. We know that because of the garland he's carrying on his wand. And he is surrounded by people who are welcoming him home. They're welcoming their conquering hero into their midst. So the image suggests that this man has been pursuing a passion project, has been following his dream, and there are people around him that really support that. They're excited for him. They're adding their enthusiasm and their celebration to him, which creates harmony. It means he is in harmony with the people around him, which, you know, connects to the idea of community, a supportive community. And so when this card shows up, it suggests to me that we are looking, we want to acknowledge there are people around us who think we're pretty awesome, who are excited for us. Maybe they don't completely understand what we're doing, which is usually the case, but they have faith in us and they're they're exhilarated by what we're doing and they, they feel the impact of what we're doing. And so they help us feel in harmony in the world. And this is a really nice card to follow up yesterday's card because the Six of Swords is about the mind finding harmony. And to do that, the mind must leave behind a an old structure which feels familiar and travel across the body of water which represents intuition to create a new homeland a new structure that is more in harmony with what we're doing but in that transition period the mind can be feeling pretty shaky i mean literally in the image they're on a body of water so that's not very stable so what occurs to me is the mind is going through this transition, leaving something familiar behind and looking to create something new. And the six of wands can support the mind in this time of transition. Because even though the mind is not totally clear of what's going to happen next and might be feeling a bit insecure, there are these people around the mind that can offer, um, that offer their enthusiasm and their faith in what is happening. So even though the mind doesn't feel totally secure, it can feel soothed and supported by the fact that other people believe in in you and in it and in this journey. So be aware of the people around you who are your cheerleaders and spend some time with them. Let them see your passion, see your joy, and let them affirm it for you. Um, that's something we, we sometimes fail to do. We tend to focus on our critics and we fail to connect with those who are supporting us. And we really should do the opposite. So today, find your supporters and let them support you and let your mind feel soothed by the fact that you're not crazy after all. See you tomorrow for our next card. Bye. Hey, everybody. Thank you for watching my channel. If you want more content from me, please check in with my Patreon community, or you can check out my new book, The Gospel According to Tarot. The details are listed below. Hope to see you soon. Bye.